Alright guys, here we are once again, Earthbound. Now, this spot right here is a very good spot to level up because this gentleman right here will let you rest with some tea. Restores your HP. It's pretty good. Pretty good indeed. I am level 6 now. And I don't want to fight that. But no, don't make me fight it. I don't want to. Ah! What is it with me? It just makes things worse. How the hell did I hit the goat? The, the goat was on another ledge! Well, anyway, it's a good chance to show you the gruff goat. These guys are quite annoying. They can tear into you, and that does a lot of damage. They do become somewhat trivial around level 5 or 6, though. They do... I don't want a salt packet. No, thank you. They do, however, give 20 experience. staying the night, whereas doing some tea is not. It's, it's kind of like staying at uh, your house versus staying uh, with Frank. It, it's, uh, yeah. If the screen goes black, Jeff has a chance of fixing an item like he did there. So now I have the defense spray. It's a one-time use item. Uh, not very good, honestly. Fuzzy Pickles! These guys don't say anything different, I don't think. Some of the more relaxing music in the game right here. Well, not yet, but soon when there's actually music.
and thank you, Bubble Monkey. Let's see. Don't want to fight that gruff goat. If I can help it. Do do do. Doesn't look like I can help it. Yep. These guys are easy now. Oh look, a pencil statue. Too bad we don't have a. What'd that say? Okay. Oh, look at that. It is a rowdy mouse. Huh. Yeah, these guys in this dungeon area are going to mostly be rehashes of enemies. We fought in Giant Step and places like that. Oh, yay, a bread roll. I always do that. I always leave this one behind. Oh, look, it's a duck. The mad duck. They can drain your PP and make it to where you can't use your psychic abilities at all. But that doesn't really affect Jeff in the slightest, considering he doesn't have any psychic powers. It's kind of funny. He's the smartest character in the game. And I don't want insecticide spray. It's worthless. Worthless protoplasm. Ah, uh, yes. They are indeed worthless. But they can call for help, so that's something to watch out for. And they do hit decently hard, they just don't give any good experience or anything. That was not a very good level up. Ooh, yes, I think that is the slime generator. What does this say? Watch out for falling materials. Brick Road. Fuzzy Pickles! And uh, that is... Well, I don't know, I've lost count of what picture the spot that is. Dun, dun, dun. Ah, shit. Here we go. Well, anyway. There is one item in here I definitely want. It is not the croissant. But I will take the croissant. I would like to point out that I think this is the only boiled egg in the game. I don't think there's actually any more of those. Anyway, almost out of time, but we're almost out of this dungeon as well. Ouch, that mouse hit me. Hit me very hard. Yes, the stun gun, that's what I want. Let's see. And, welcome to the end of this modest dungeon, Brick Road. Of course, that's not what that said. And there is Brick Road. No, it was, uh, 
It, it was kind of easy. Dungeon Man! Sure. Anyway, the next time on Earthbound, we're going to continue on and hopefully reach Dr. Donut's lab in the next video. I hope to see you then.